From ancient Egyptian times to a modern household staple, beer has had a long-standing relationship with humanity. With evidence suggesting beer fermentation took place as early as 13,000 years ago, what was known as liquid bread is the oldest drink produced by humans. Well, beer is a unique alcoholic beverage in that it's low in alcohol, so it's a drink of moderation. It's also thirst quenching and refreshing, so I think beer goes well in many situations. It just makes it a very enjoyable product that people love to drink. And the other thing is beer is made practically all over the world and in each region where it's brewed, the local grains and products, microflora, the yeast, all affect the character of the beer. And then the culture and, and customs of those regions also influence how the beer is made and how it's served. So there's such a unique variety of beers all over the world. It's, it's incredibly diverse uh, beverage and there's a style for almost everyone's taste. There's a lot that, that you have to understand in order to manage the brewing process well. Um, there are enzymes in the malt that break down complex starches into sugars that the yeast can, can then eat. The fermentation process has to be managed in terms of the temperature and the strength of the wort and the amount of yeast that you introduce to the wort. To be honest, there's a, a lot of science that you have to master in terms of the machines that help you make the beer. A huge part of what you have to learn is how to manage these machines so that you can get your final product to have the right uh, look, mouthfeel, level of oxygen as low as possible, and many other factors. There are believed to be over 100 different beer styles around the world. From pilsners to creamy ales to funky sours, brewers have found ways to manipulate tried and true recipes to craft beers of all kinds. Though, like most things, nothing compares to the traditional practices of beer making, especially those held by Germans. I think German beer is all the history of, uh, especially Bavaria, about uh, German brewing. The beer is very respected in, in the sense of as being a light drinking alcohol uh, beverage. It's brewed very natural, in a very natural way, with no artificial ingredients. German beer is known for its quality and outstanding flavor. Breweries like Kansas City Beer Company aim to preserve that excellence within their brews. Kansas City Beer Company is transporting Germany to the United States. Founder Steve Holly, entranced by the taste of German beers, set out to recreate that experience in Kansas City. Through traditional brewing methods and imported ingredients, KCBC is bringing that authentic German flavor to Missouri. We felt that people in the United States would really embrace German beer styles if they just had a chance to taste it the way it tastes in Germany. We import all of our malt and hops from Germany. Myself and our head brewer both went to brewing school in Bavaria. So we try to model our brewing techniques and our ingredients and our recipes after traditional ones in Germany. So there's a few fundamental things that you do when you make a traditional German style beer that most other breweries would not do. One of them is uh, called decoction mashing, where instead of just raising the temperature of your mashed grains from one point to another by heating it up with direct fire or steam power, you actually take a portion of that mash, pull it aside and boil it, and then reintroduce it to the main portion of the mash, and that raises the temperature of the whole. Uh, that process develops a little bit of malt complexity, some mouthfeel, some roundness and, and fullness to the malt character that you wouldn't get otherwise. So it takes time, energy, effort in the brew day to, to do that, but we do it because we're trying to replicate uh, and make the most authentic version of our Bavarian beer styles that we possibly can. Beer in its purest form is one of the most natural and untainted consumer products in the world. KCBC embraces this by employing passionate artisans and utilizing unparalleled ingredients, ensuring that with each batch, they put the I back in beer. It's really been a blessing to work with the, the crew here from the packaging to the brewers. Uh, everybody is so dedicated to their craft and really take pride. And that's the thing that produces great beers with the people that make it take pride in what they make and it shows in the quality of the product that's produced. A commitment to tradition.